everybody, Maction here, and we're looking at the lovely hand and phone of David Chu from Senseg. Now, haptic feedback is something you've heard about, but up until now, it's mostly just been vibrating your entire device when you touch it. But Senseg has a more, more subtle solution for us. David, what? Uh, tell us what you've been working on. Okay, so Senseg has been working on a new haptic technology, which is based on electrostatic force. This is a Sensec demo, and what you'll be able to see is that as we as I roll along the ball on, on along the track, on the left hand side of the circle is very smooth. But with Sensex haptic feedback technology, is that you know when you move across the ridges on the right hand side, the f the person's finger, i.e. in this case my finger, would be able to feel that as in that I'm moving over the ridges on on my cell phone. Mm -hmm. And even even as I go around the circle, once it gets here, the electrostatic force is causing my finger to hesitate slightly, creating this, uh, uh, creating the feedback of the ridges themselves as I drag it along. The other things that we can do with this haptics technology is to giving the user various kind of textures feeling. In this case, we have a very rough surfaces, for example, like a sandpaper. As you move along the line, you would feel kind of a roughness surface on it. The other applications, that, let's say for example the screen size of the smartphone today are getting bigger and bigger and there might be some instances that you may want to segregate um, you know, portions of, of, of the screen. So in this case, in this demo, as you move your slide your finger from one section to the next, the user would know that they are crossing from one box to the next by having an edge feeling right in between the boxes. In this demo, I would be able to select a word by long tapping it and with my drag of my finger, for every letter or alphabet that we, we, we select or we go through or we highlight, you, I would be actually getting a critical click feeling on my finger. That would enable me to be selecting text a lot faster and be a lot more accurate than without having this haptic feeling. How is it actually making the electrostatic force? Correct. So our chipset inside the cell phone would drive the electrostatic on the conductive coating on the on the surface of the smartphones and now by holding the phone you are actually completing a circuit between the persons the finger as well as the cell phone that will enable the electrostatic charge to have to maximize impact to the person's sensation because at the current moment David is holding it and I can still feel the uh, I can still feel the sensation but if I put it in my hand and move my own finger the sensation becomes more pronounced. In fact, this technology, we're throwing it out to, to the community, to the software community, and I would love to hear any ideas of what you might, you guys might think that this might be useful for, for developing apps. If you guys have any decent ideas, please do get in touch with us. You know, we would love to be working together with you guys to, to get, you know, interesting applications or demos or games out to the market so that, you know, we get the um, people to be interested in this technology. Well, thank you so much for meeting with us. It looks fantastic and, well, it feels fantastic.